Hey guys, Susie here. Thanks for tuning in today. So today I'm sharing a product review with you guys. And the products that I am reviewing are two of the products from the Nuance line by Selma Hayek. I purchased both of these skincare products at CVS and they are a mask and a facial cream cleanser. Um, if you guys remember a couple months back, I was going through like a really stressful time. I just had a lot of issues going on, but one of the big issues that I had going on was my skin. Uh, I had major, major breakouts on my face. Um, right around Christmas time, it really started getting bad. I was covering up lots and lots of blemishes with concealer. I just had like my whole forehead was breaking out. Um, I was just breaking out all over my face, really. And I wasn't sure where it was really coming from. I figured, I guess it was because, you know, from the stress and everything and I'm breaking out. Um, I hadn't really changed up my skincare routine or anything. And so I was pretty sure it wasn't from anything I was really using. But I thought, well, maybe now is the time for me to purchase a new uh, facial skincare system and try it out. Maybe I'll go for something a little bit gentler on my skin because I was like, dried out on my face but I was still breaking out so obviously it wasn't really an issue of oil control I don't know what the deal was but I thought let me try out something gentle something that you know will be gentle on my skin but still you know clean my face really good hopefully help with my blemishes and so that's what led me to purchase these and try them out and I'm really just wanting to do this review for you guys because I didn't hear or know anything about these when I bought them. I mean, I literally didn't even know this existed. I never knew that Salma Hayek even had a line of skincare products or makeup or anything. I had no idea. And so I went into buying these with absolutely no background on them, uh, just not knowing anything about them. And I mean, I was kind of pleased and kind of displeased. And so... I really wanted to share with you guys what I thought about these and another reason why is because these are not cheap. Um, this cream cleanser I believe was like close to $10 or so, like it could have been $9 or $10 at CVS possibly and this white clay treatment mask was definitely about $10 or $12 at CVS. So these were not cheap by any means. Um, I actually thought, you know, let me let me get these. They're a little bit more expensive, but maybe they'll be really good. And if I had known some of the things that I know about these now, I possibly would have steered clear of one of the products. I would have preferred to try something else instead. So anyway, let's get into this review, and I will let you guys know what I thought of these. So the first product we're going to be talking about is the Nuance Chamomile Facial Cream Cleanser with rice bran, passion fruit, and babasu oils. I'm not sure what that is. Uh, Soap-free formula, cleanses, and tones, all skin types. And I've used roughly half of this. It's not my everyday cleanser, and I will tell you guys why in just a second, but I have used about half of it, so about that much. Um, basically, on the back, it just says that the chamomile and rice bran oil help naturally soothe, calm, and relieve dry skin. Passion fruit oil softens and nourishes skin and helps retain moisture. And the babasu oil is ultra rich and hydrating with a non-greasy feel. And by the way, let me mention that these are not tested on animals. They're paraben free, allergy tested, dermatologist tested, and non-irritating. So they are safe for sensitive skin. So um, basically my thoughts of this are um, I really like the consistency that it's a cream cleanser as you can see there it just literally looks like um, face cream probably and the smell is really nice um, it's not like an overpowering ultra strong smell now I can't still can't smell very well because I'm still a little bit sick but um, it has a really nice fresh clean smell not you know fruity not citrusy not floral just literally a nice fresh like clean soapy type smell and I really like the the formula consistency is really nice I uh, also really like that it is very gentle on your skin I mean very very gentle like I have sensitive skin this doesn't dry me out at all it's not greasy either so it's very good for sensitive skin however this is the bad point of it all um, this face wash 
is absolutely horrible at actually cleaning your skin. I, I honestly do not feel like it cleans my skin well at all and it's horrible, horrible, horrible at makeup removal. I literally tried to use this the very first time when I got it and I was trying to wash my face at night, get my makeup off and it was literally just smearing makeup around on my face. It was not washing it off at all. Um, just really, really did not wash off anything. Um, not even my face makeup, not my eye makeup. It was just smearing it all around everywhere. So that kind of um, turned me off to this. So basically, I, I couldn't use this anymore for makeup removal, which is like a big thing to me because I do wear makeup on a daily basis pretty much. I need a soap that's going to be removing my makeup. So I had to start using something else. And I've been using um, I've been using a Trader Joe's facial wash that I that I really like, and I'll probably review for you guys. But as far as this goes, I have not been using it to remove my makeup. I only use it in the shower on days where I don't already have makeup on, or I removed it the night before, and I need to wash my face that morning because I know my face is already pretty clean. I just need like a you know just a slight wash or whatever in the shower or in the sink, you know, I don't need to like deep clean my face or anything or remove makeup. That's when I use this. So for the price, I was very disappointed that this didn't remove my makeup at all. I feel like it's almost a little too gentle. Um, if you're someone that doesn't wear makeup, this is going to be right up your alley because it'll just, you know, gently clean your face and you don't have to worry about makeup removal. But for me, um, yeah, it just didn't really cut it. So I was disappointed that for the price, I couldn't even remove my makeup with this and it really didn't clean my face very well. The other product I got is the Ageless Clarity White Clay Treatment Mask and these got some weird extracts in it, I tell you. With Tepesochu Hoot, I don't know, Lemon and Calendula Extracts. So that's what that packaging looks like. And I have used this roughly two times. I really, really enjoy it. I like this packaging. It's a little bit different than the other one, so I do like that. And this says, helps cleanse, absorb excess oil, and improve skin tone for a clear, radiant complexion. And uh, basically, this says back here, white clay helps absorb oil, cleanse pores for clear, healthy-looking skin. This Tepe Zetchu, I don't know what that is. And lemon extract lift away dead skin cells and help improve skin tone to reveal a bright radiant complexion and the calendula extract helps soothe and calm skin. Basically what you do is you just wash your face. They prefer you washing with the Salma Hayek cleanser and then you apply this and let it dry for about five minutes. You know you'll feel it be kind of dried on your face and then you just rinse off with like lukewarm or warm water. So that's how you use it. Um, this was a little bit more expensive than the face wash, but I am very pleasantly pleased with this. I, in fact, I would repurchase this. I really, really like it. Um, again, it has that really fresh, clean, kind of soapy smell to it, which I, I actually really enjoy because it's gentle. It's not overpowering or anything. Um, what I really like about it is that, you know, I put it on and it, and it did dry fairly quickly as in like five minutes or so. And I rinsed it off. My skin just felt so clean and so like just clear. And it, it even looked a little bit more radiant. It looked like it had a more of a glow to it. Just really did a nice job um, just kind of making my skin feel clean and moisturized and fresh. But that is my review of these. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I will try to leave links down below to the CVS site so maybe you guys can read more about these. If I can find them on their website, I will leave links. And I do highly recommend this uh, treatment mask. It's very nice, very good for um, just kind of moisturizing, hydrating, soothing your skin, and helping to add that glow. And I wouldn't really recommend this uh, facial cleanser because just didn't really do a thing for me. It didn't even clean my makeup off. So hope you guys enjoyed this review. If you have any questions, please leave them down below. Have you tried anything from this line and what do you think about it? Let me know in the comments down below and I'll catch you guys in my next video. So don't forget to subscribe. Bye guys. I'll see you later.